Good evening everyone and welcome to Heathcote. Welcome to the Modern Foreign Languages Department at Heathcote. I want to tell you a little bit about what happens in Heathcote when you have language lessons. Now first and foremost, currently, Key Stage 3, that's U789, you study either French or Spanish. And then in Year 9, obviously, you get to choose which one you'd like to continue with, French or Spanish. Now currently, the way the lessons are, you will be focusing on different skill areas and different topics. So the four main skills we're going to be looking at are listening, speaking, reading and writing, and including translating, that's both from English into either French or Spanish, or from French or Spanish into English. This is a really important skill to have, and it will serve you very well. Just being able to speak another language opens the door to many opportunities out there in the world. So I hope that you'll thoroughly enjoy studying languages with us here at Heathcote. Now you're thinking, what kind of things might we learn in a French or Spanish lesson? Well, some of the topics we look at enable you to be able to have a conversation in the target language. So you might learn how to introduce yourself. Perhaps you already know this from primary school. Bonjour, salut, hello, hi. Je m'appelle Madame Collins. Maybe you've learned that already. Perhaps you've learned a little more. When you come along here to Heathcote, you're going to be able to grow in your knowledge and understanding of the amazing thing of that a language is. So let me tell you a little bit about how the lessons run here. So we have a week A and a week B, so that's called a two-week timetable. In each week, you will have a language lesson. So you will have consistency. You will also have opportunities to use different resources. Sometimes we use the whiteboard and we might have an activity like this where we use symbols and words and from that you are able to write out an entire conversation in the target language. We also read original texts. We might get a French magazine or a Spanish magazine. We use original resources. We might listen to a French song or a Spanish song and you might learn how to translate the lyrics. Wouldn't that be amazing to be able to listen to a song in another language and actually understand it? So that's one of the things we might do. Some of the books we use are pretty lovely too. So for example, in year seven and eight, we might use Aviva, which is a lovely colorful book with lots of different exercises. And it's got some real pictures of Spain. And for French, we have Studio. Now at GCC, this is the studio book that we use and it covers all the themes that you need to take your end of Key Stage 4 exams. So this is what that looks like. So it covers topics that are of interest to you. We also have dictionaries. Ça c'est un dictionnaire français. Esa es un diccionario español. We have access to these in the classroom and they're a great resource for helping you to become a more independent learner. We also have these amazing things called the knowledge organizers, which you all get in year seven. So this is French. So for example, if you open the French page, look at what you get. It's beautiful. So you've got some interesting vocabulary, how to tell the time, how to describe yourself, look, eyes and hair, how to greet someone, colors, the verb avoir and other verbs that are of equal importance, how to say what the weather is like, how to name the months. These are full of really useful bits, little nuggets of information that will aid in the development of your language. So what else can I tell you? Well, there's something exciting that we've done, which is take trips abroad, where you have the opportunity to practice the language that you've learned in school out there in the actual context of the country. So we've done trips to Lille and there are trips to France and Spain and that is something that is on the agenda and we have done it in the past. So that's something else that's exciting. Not only are you learning the language but you'll have the opportunity to actually 
put it into effect, put it into practice in the context of the country itself. And one more thing I want to tell you is about the um, fact that we are very much looking forward to welcoming all of you to Heathcote and especially to the Modern Lo uh, Foreign Languages Department. So, merci, au revoir, gracias, adios. <laughs>